Long ago, in a distant corner of the universe, a magnificent explosion of gamma rays erupted, releasing an unimaginable amount of energy in just a mere half second. This burst of energy surpassed anything the sun could ever hope to produce in its entire 10 billion year existence. Let's unravel the mystery beyond this phenomena, but before we embark on this thrilling journey, don't forget to subscribe to stay updated expanse of a moonlit sky, a serene stillness envelops those who venture into their own backyards to gaze at the stars. Picture this, the sky, a mesmerizing canvas of vibrant colors, illuminated by bursts of light that dance and twinkle like the flashes of paparazzi cameras. Many of these flashes are the result of magnificent stellar explosions or cosmic collisions. These elusive phenomena can only be detected by the unwavering gaze of telescopes, which tirelessly scan the night sky in search of these fleeting moments. In May of 2020, a brilliant flash of light embarked on an extraordinary journey through the vastness of space. After traversing unimaginable distances, this celestial spectacle finally arrived on Earth. It was at this moment that the keen eyes of NASA's Neo Garrel Swift Observatory caught sight of this wondrous phenomenon, marking the beginning of an incredible discovery. Scientists wasted no time in enlisting the help of other telescopes, including NASA's Hubble Space Telescope, to delve into the aftermath of the explosion and explore the mysteries of the host galaxy. Surprisingly, it was Hubble that stole the show. When astronomers laid their eyes on the data from Hubble, they were left completely puzzled. The near-infrared emission they observed was a whopping 10 times brighter than what they had expected. This unexpected discovery left them scratching their heads, trying to make sense of what they were seeing. The results presented here defy traditional theories regarding the events following a brief gamma ray burst. There is a potential scenario where the observations could be indicative of the emergence of a colossal, intensely magnetized neuron star known as magnetar. These observations challenge the conventional explanations for short gamma ray burst, stated Wen Fei Fong, the leader of the study from Northwestern University in Evanston, Illinois. Considering the information we have about the radio and x-rays emitted by this explosion, it simply doesn't align. The brightness of the near-infrared emission that was detected by Hubble is quite remarkable. When it comes to piecing together the mystery of this gamma ray burst, there seems to be one puzzle piece that just doesn't quite fit right. The universe never fails to amaze with its incredible array of explosions, showcasing its boundless diversity. It's truly a thrilling sight to behold. It would appear that the gamma ray bursts are produced by material jets that are traveling at speeds that are very close to the speed of light. On the other hand, these jets have a relatively modest amount of mass, which might be as little as a percent of the mass of the sun. On the other hand, as they travel across space at extraordinary speeds, a tremendous quantity of energy is released and it spreads across the full spectrum of light. Scientists were able to detect light across the full electromagnetic spectrum, which is an extremely rare occurrence. This specific gamma ray burst was one of the exceptional examples that occurred. Scientists were eagerly awaiting for a mesmerizing event of kilonova, which was expected to coincide with a fleeting burst of gamma rays. A kilonova's peak brightness far surpasses that of a traditional nova, reaching levels that are a thousand times greater. Only through the rare union of two neutron stars or the fusion of a neutron star with a minuscule black hole can the mesmerizing phenomenon known as a kilonova occur. This captivating display of light, visible and infrared in its essence, is brought forth by the gradual decay of weighty elements. Fong and her team have explored various hypotheses to unravel the mystery behind the intriguing brightness that caught Hubble's attention. There were two neutron stars that decided to join forces. Little did they know, their fusion would create something extraordinary. A magnetar. This magnificent celestial being was no ordinary neutron star. It possessed a magnetic field so powerful it could make your head spin. In contrast to the majority of short gamma ray bursts, it is highly possible that these events led to the formation 
of a black hole. Through this sudden burst, Hubble showcased its extraordinary sensitivity in the near-infrared spectrum, ultimately playing a crucial role in determining the final result. In a stunning display of efficiency, Hubble managed to capture an image a mere three days after the explosion. As the story unfolded, the Hubble Space Telescope revealed a captivating series of photos that showcased a fascinating phenomenon. In these images, it became apparent that a certain source gradually faded away in the aftermath of the explosion. However, there is a distinction between this and a static source that remains unchanged over time. Upon discovering these findings, they realized that they had not only pinpointed the source of the phenomenon, but also stumbled upon something truly remarkable and exceptionally uncommon. The Hubble Space Telescope played a crucial role in enabling us to accurately measure the light emitted from the merger and pinpoint the exact location of the burst. Now in 2023, the Hubble Space Telescope, a remarkable collaboration between the European Space Agency and the USA, has uncovered an extraordinary and enigmatic source of light in the vast expanse of the universe. Out of nowhere, a mysterious phenomenon called a luminous fast blue optical transient made its unexpected appearance in a location far removed from any known host galaxy. The exact location could only be pinpointed by Hubble. Surprising discoveries from the Hubble Space Telescope have left astronomers with more questions and answers as they debunked several previously held beliefs about these mysterious objects. Within the vastness of the universe, LFBOTs shine with a brilliance that is unmatched by any other celestial event. They are really intriguing celestial phenomena. In the same way that the sudden flash of light from a camera may take you by surprise, they occur in an instant and take you by surprise simultaneously. The quantity of these discoveries has been quite low ever since it was first discovered in the year of 2018. In the present moment, the rate at which LFBOTs are being discovered is approximately one per year. After the first sighting of the latest LFBOT, various telescopes across the electromagnetic spectrum, ranging from X-rays to radio frequencies, managed to spot it. It was only through the remarkable precision of the Hubble Space Telescope that its exact location could be determined. The transitory event, also known as the Finch, was given the designation AT2023FHN. It exhibited all the characteristic features of an LFBOT. With a brilliant blue glow, it underwent a rapid evolution, reaching its peak brightness before gradually fading over the course of a few days. This was quite different from supernovae, which can take weeks or even months to lose their luminosity. Unlike any other LFBOT observed before, Hubble made a fascinating discovery. The Finch is found in a seemingly isolated spot, nestled between two neighboring galaxies. Located at a staggering distance of 50,000 light years from a neighboring spiral galaxy and a mere 15,000 light years away from a smaller galaxy, this celestial object captivates with its cosmic allure. Within this enigmatic place, celestial objects that were once thought to reside within galaxies now find themselves in a state of perplexity. There is a fascinating theory that suggests these mind-blowing explosions are a rare type of supernova called core collapse supernovae. Interestingly, the massive stars that go through this transformation have a relatively short lifespan compared to other stars. As a result, the mighty stars that give birth to supernovae don't get much chance to venture far from their birthplace, a bustling gathering of freshly formed stars. All of the previous LFBOTs have been found in the spiral arms of galaxies, where new stars are constantly being born. As the researchers delve into their investigation, they explore an intriguing hypothesis. Could it be that the Finch originated from a cosmic encounter between two neutron stars? These celestial objects, having ventured far from their galactic abode, gradually drew closer over the course of billions of years, eventually culminating in a dramatic collision. Consider this alternative explanation they are contemplating to make sense of the particle's unusual location. These collisions give rise to the creation of a kilonova, an explosion that surpasses the power of a regular nova by a thousandfold. However, 
there is a fascinating idea that some scientists have put forth. They propose that if one of the neutron stars possesses a strong magnetic field, also known as a magnetar, it could potentially amplify the explosion's intensity. In fact, this amplification could make the brightness of the explosion a hundred times greater than that of a regular supernova. Due to the unpredictable nature of astronomical transients, astronomers heavily rely on wide field surveys to detect and notify other observatories about their presence. These surveys continuously monitor large portions of the sky, allowing for prompt follow-up investigations by observatories like Hubble. Researchers have found that a larger sample size is needed to gain a more comprehensive understanding of the phenomenon. It is possible that in the future, advanced all-sky survey telescopes may be able to detect even more celestial objects. However, this possibility hinges on our understanding of the underlying astrophysics. Make sure to like and subscribe to stay updated with our latest content. And thanks for tuning in.